Hi viewers, welcome to Gunny SK YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to explain you how to create valid T connection in Tecla structures, just like this. Okay, let's start. Open your Tecla structures with the US environment. Now we are going to create beam. So click on steel and select this beam and pick the first point and second point to create the beam, just like this. Now we are going to create the one more beam. So pick the first point at here and pick the second point at here. To create the beam like this right click on mouse interrupt now we're going to change the profile of this beam so double click on this beam by default we have w16 by 40 so click on here and now we're going to change the size of this beam let's take w12 by 40 then click on apply ok then click on modify you can see just like this and close this window click on space right click on mouse view. Okay, now we're going to create the connection between these two beams so Click on application and components and in search bar type here number 32. Okay, now we're going to create this welded T32 connection. So select this component welded T32 and pick the primary beam and pick the secondary beam to create the connection between two beams and close this window. Right click on mouse interrupt, click on space, right click on mouse state of view. You can see by default we have the connection just like this. Okay, now we're going to edit this connection. So double click on this connection. You can see now we're going to change the spacing uh, between. Web to uh, the secondary beam gap. So let's take here half inch. Then click on modify. You can see now we have the space between two. Click on, click on this beam and use the shortcut control R and pick the rotation point and you can rotate just like this. You can see now we have the gap between two beams of inch. Now you can see just like this. Okay, this gap should be off inch. Now uh, click on parts. Now you can change this or profile, this T profile. So to change this pro T profile, just click on here and by default we have the WT by 11. Uh, for example, we are going to take W6, WT6 by 15. Then click on apply OK. Then click on modify. You can see now this profile has been changed. You can see. Just like this. click on space right your mouse of view now select this component uh, now to adjust this board number of boards and board spacing then click on this secondary boards and click on here and select the uh, size of this board let's take 3 by 4 inch and tolerance we are going to take 1 16th now coming to here top of this mm, beam to first board distance currently we have 3 inch let's take 4 inch now we're going to change this uh, edge distance here 1.5 inch and the number of volts we're going to take 3 inches uh, let's take 2.5 inch and le let's take 1.5 inch edge distance from ball to edge of this plate okay in this direction uh, let's take here the edge distance 3 inches and number of volts we're going to take 1 volt then click on modify you can see now we have the 3 volts and uh, edge distance should be 1.5 inches and uh, spacing between the two boards should be 2 inches and in this direction we have the edge distance 3 inches okay if you want to place the two rows of bolts here then you need to enter here the two rows and let's take the edge distance 1.5 and the spacing is 2 then click on modify you can see you can create just like this okay now we're going to take here 2.5 inches uh, spacing between the two walls and uh, this two inch indicates the edge of this plate to first bolt distance from here to here okay that's it about how to create a welded T connection in the cloth structures between the two beams just like this okay 
right click on mouse interrupt click on space right click on mouse view you can see just like this okay that's it if you have any doubts please comment below if you like this video please like it and share it for more tech class structure related videos please go to my channel youtube.com slash gunny sk i will provide this link in the description below of this video please go through it and come here under videos you can find so many tech class structure related videos i hope these videos may be helpful to you and at the top right corner please click on subscribe button if you subscribe you will get notification or updates when upload a new video so please click on subscribe okay thank you